Hunter, Clint Capello, and Danilo Gallinari. Kalena's buddy for Atlanta, the starters. And Herter for three, third best three point shooting team in the NBA. And it'll be interesting is how he plays with Clay and Wiggins to begin. And you want to keep moving if he gets the ball in the post. And then rebounding will be an issue with Capella as he gets the Gallinari miss three. Wiggins opens on Trey Young. Trey Young step back is perfect. They run a lot of different types of pick and rolls. Green, know what the defensive game plan is on those. Clay Thompson, a good look. And he was already running back. I like that Wiggins Thompson. And he figured if he just shot it when he did, that would be his best opening. He was right. DeAndre Hunter, well defended, but a better shot. The same kind of thing, though. He would. Atlanta is bottom five defensively, but they're an elite offensive team. The hook pass all the way out to Herder. His three on the way is good. I think Trey Young is threatening. The defense collapses. He gets the ball moving. Jordan Poole with a triple in response. Yeah, the screener's defender just isn't close. Benga missing the three. Warriors have taken a lot of early threes here. Herder with the up and under. And the rebound battle. When you got Capella, you better get a body on him. He gets almost four on tournament spot. And they have a chance to get to ninth. But offensively, they're one of the best in the league, and they really take care of the ball. Clay Thompson missing there, but Draymond on the rebound. Clay on a reload three and drops it in. So Clay's hit two threes already. And good to see him line it up from the exact same spot. Chances are he's going to make one. Gallinari wants to post up Jordan. Make sure you don't want to foul Gallo. Gets it into Capella at point blank range. <laughs> I always think in between trying to make the skip pass and pass it to Capella. Good thing Capella kind of stole it. Kaminga can drive on Gallinari. I mean, it, he scores right over him. Gallinari, as he's gotten over it a little bit, they need to attack that. And that was actually good defense from Gallinari, but acrobatic shot from Kaminga. Now, this is what Gallinari can do well, though. He hits the three. And that's what happens when they get the drives. It sucks. They kick it back out to the shooters. That's why they're so good shooting the ball, because they get it inside first a lot of times. Raymond kind of directing traffic here. Setting up Jordan with the shot clock at 11. Wiggins post up. And Jordan Poole, he's been that hot. Launch it in. It's kind of surprising to me the way they're playing it. Gallinari, deep position, so Gallo early is rolling. So he gives them that post threat too, and they, they run some creative plays to get him in there, a little screen. And the Warriors didn't have the advantage there. Clay Thompson and Capella met Kaminga up top. Nice defense. And Clay, they trade three for two. Instead of a Kaminga dunk, it's a Thompson three. That's the kind of start you want to see Clay have. If you're the Warriors, I like Clay's pass though to Kaminga. That was a good sign too. Clay kept Trey Young in front of him, and now Young had to give it up. Kevin Herter from deep. He's got a great nickname. They call him Red Velvet, <laughs> and sometimes that jumper can be very smooth. Sometimes, all the time, it always looks good. Jordan Poole just attacking Trey Young. Man, he's staying assertive and aggressive. Make Trey Young work on this side. Capella on the roll, and they are late. They foul him, and he lays it up and in. Trey Young's instincts and pick and rolls, the way he just reads the defense, is so good. Two defenders stayed with him. He's able to make that pocket pass. Watch Looney slide over. He's not going to be able to get back to the roll, so Kavinka kind of recognizes it just a little late. And Capella is able to finish pretty strong. That's what I talked about. The pick and roll defense is going to be the challenge tonight. And that's the thing. When you have Looney Draymond together, they do that like breathing. Kaminga is young. And so learning all the nuances defensively is something that rookies have to go through. But that's the dilemma with guarding this team. If you bring that third defender, you're going to leave a shooter. So you almost got to pick your poison from the weak side. Kaminga, he's got an ISO. Lost the handle. Looney trying to get on the deck. And you're going to get a jump ball. Kaminga had the right idea. He had Capella on him. And he's just trying to expose him. Use his quickness to get by him. But 
Let's count you if you want it. I mean, Looney or Pool there, but now Trey Young's going to move between them. Taking a lot of time to throw the ball up here with only two to shoot. There's no reset of the shot clock. Musical chairs. And so that's the worst of every world because Trey Young got a layup off the jump ball. Those are the type of plays on the road. Those are the plays that get you beat. Andrew Wiggins for three. The Warriors have really started to bomb from the arc here. As Kalena pointed out with Capella sitting back, I mean, it's a shooting gallery right now. If you make them six of nine, it looks awfully good. But that time Wiggins' defender went under the screen too, so that helped. And skip pass, Lawalo Cabarro. Missing that three, can make a high for the rebound. Jordan Poole, nice screen by Wiggins. And GP2, an acrobatic finish. The little big man just hanging around that restricted circle. Opportunist on the offensive boards. Until that last miss, Atlanta had hit six straight shots. So for the Dubs, clearly this end of the floor as they force Hunt.